Okay, so what am I going to do with this hair today? I untangled the, I loosened the braids. And I am going to try a product to see if it will bring out the curl in my hair. Like I said, I am an experimenter of whatever I can get my hands on because I like to experiment. So, this is all, this is my afro after the banana and honey wash that I did in my previous video. And it's smelling really good. Mmm, smells like honey. Okay. I'm going to finger comb all the curls out. I'm getting a lot of good tips from you sisters on YouTube to how to take care of your God-given afro. And one thing that I have to learn to do is to not, not is to not rip my hair out, which I really like doing. So that's a habit that I'm going to have to try and get rid of and use my fingers because I really don't need a comb. I mean, my fingers are all that is needed to take tangles out of my hair. And it makes perfect sense because if you look at black hair, you will see that the, the kink is very kinky which simply means that a comb will rip it apart very easily there we go put a comb through that and you're gonna be missing some hair well we really don't need a comb when you got fingers okay so the fingers and the beauty about using your fingers is that your fingers can feel when there is a knot a comb can't. Duh. So your fingers know there's a knot there and you will just loosen it up. There we go again. There's no knot. So the fingers are the perfect comb. The best comb for your hair. Okay. Now you just all you have to do is comb through with your fingers and gently unloosen those tangles. Okay, we can see. That's the kink, that's the curls that bumps right back up. So anyways, what I'm gonna do with this hair is I'm going to see how it, this product redefines the curls. Let me get the product and show you what the product is, okay? Okay, so the product is S Curl, and it says Curl Activator Moisturizer. Let's see if it can moisturize this Afro Thunder. Ooh, right here. Okay, let's do the directions. It says to whole bottle six inches from here, spray S Curl Activator and Moisturizer evenly over the entire head using fingertips massage completely through the hair then style as desired use daily to maintain proper moisture balance hmm it didn't say i needed to get my hair wet well let's figure this out i was positive it was going to say get my hair wet so let's work on this piece right here okay i want to work on this piece right here spray huh. my finger is not strong enough. Work it down, work it down. Smells so good. Woo! Smells good. Very good. Hmm. Water could have done that. Let me try some more. I think I'm an instant gratification kind of person because I don't have any patience. I want the curls to pop right now curl activator. 
don't see nothing activating. Let's let me have some patience. Massage it with the fingers, so they say. Mm -hmm. Okay, what's happening? Am I getting curls? Okay, so they got it in my eye. My eye's burning. So that's my curls. When I use the S curl activator on dry hair. For my amount of hair, this ain't gonna be enough. I'm gonna need like 10 bottles to use this on a daily basis. Can't even see where I'm spraying, it's turning. It's kind of greasy. Okay. I see some curls popping. Look like it's working. Open up this hair and get inside because I know it's dry inside. Open the curtains. There you go. Ain't nothing in here. Okay. Now I think that is nice. There we go. I'm gonna be doing this other side, but I'm gonna be doing this side wet. So this is dried, applied on the dry, applied on the dry side. I'm gonna get this side wet and see if it works better on wet hair. Okay, so I got my hair wet. And I think the water brought out the curls pretty good. I mean, duh. It did a better job than the S-curl. So if the water got it nicely looking like this, well, let's see what happens when I apply the S-curl. Maybe I will get the desired effect that I'm looking for. Open it up because I know it's dry inside. And it's so slippery. I'm surprised I can even get a squirt out. Alright, I'm done. It's too much work. Alright, here we go. Let's massage it like it says. Let's massage it into the hair. And see what happens. I think that
Okay, from the feel, I'm gonna tell you right now that the hair should be wet. Well, it don't have to be wet, but per your preference, per my preference, what I'm looking for, I would have to get the hair wet first. Because, it to me, it looks better and it feels better. I'm not gonna do the back. So here we have, I applied it on the dry hair. And that's, the, that's what I got. That's the look I got. Nice and fluffy. I obviously need to cut my hair today. But I'm not gonna do that right now. So there it is, nice and fluffy. And then I applied it on wet hair. And this is what I got. So, I'm going to give it a while to soak into the hair and let it dry. And then I'm going to see... The difference between the two sides. Oh God, I gotta cut this side too. Then I'm gonna see the difference between these two sides. After about, I'll give it 20 minutes. Long enough to give me enough evidence and proof that my experiment was satisfactory. Okay? Okay? Okay, so this is the after the S curl. Okay, so this half, I applied the S curl with no water. It was applied to dry hair. And this half, I applied it to wet hair. Okay. I like this half. I like this half more. If I pull down on it, let's see what happens. It will bounce back up. Yep. Sticking out that way. Now this half, I use water. And it's a whole different feel. There's more flexibility in the hair. If I pull it down and let it up, it doesn't stick out so I would say to apply this to wet hair and so that is my experiment with the S curl Act S curl no drip activator works both ways but in my opinion it works better on wet hair there we go. Pull it. Pull this hair and whoop. pull this hair and whoop. it works better on wet hair. And my hair is needing a trim. But I'm not worried about that right now. Today's the S curl experiment. There we have it with the S curl activator. No drip. Dry wet dry wet I think the wet wins so I would say wet the hair for a better desired look for your curls okay I only did the front because I'm gonna wash this out and braid my hair back the way it's supposed to be before I have to get all these little hangy parts Cut out. Okay, there it is.